Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I am back in Parenthood, as you guys can see. And today we're going to be going over the new zip lining update. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's go ahead and get into the video. Alright, so first off, I'm going to read off the tweet. This tweet was actually posted on my birthday, so that's pretty cool. Um, this tweet just says, We just put out an update including zip lining at the campsite and five new family style vehicles. There are some big updates coming this month. I wonder what's being built at the construction site. So we actually seen the construction site in the last update video that I did. So let's go ahead and go over to the zip lining because I'm actually kind of curious what that is going to be like so let's go ahead and take out a car let's take out the jeep car that we just bought and let's go ahead and get in and go to the city because oh my gosh look at my hat my hat is like totally sticking out of my car <laughs> all right so let's go ahead and go to camping so camping's going to be at our left right here to the camping island or to camp parenthood <laughs> that's so cute camp parenthood okay so let's go ahead and go up here and then oh my gosh this camera it's like wow okay the driving is definitely different in this game oh my gosh okay so let's go ahead and go up to the zip lining i don't know if we need any oh i see a little tool right there okay so let's go ahead and go ahead and check that out i've already seen the rest of the campsites and stuff in our last update video which i will leave in the eye in the corner but let's go ahead and go up here and there's a little zip line thing right here okay so right here is the little zip line tool i wonder what this looks like let's go ahead and press e oh my gosh guys look we're zip lining oh my goodness <gasps> okay so we can zip line from that tree to this tree right here which is pretty cool if we go ahead and go to this one right here we're going to be able to zip line oh my gosh wait why am i zip lining like <laughs> Why am I ziplining like to the side or something? Okay, so it looks like we um, end ziplining over here. I really want to try that again. All right, so I want to do that again because it's actually pretty cute. I kind of want to do this in first person. So let's go ahead and go into first person and look at this. Oh my gosh, we're ziplining. Oh my goodness. Woohoo. Okay, let's do this one as well. And after this, let's go ahead and take Grayson out and let's see if he zip lines too, because I'm kind of curious. So let me see. Let's go ahead and get Grayson from the daycare. Oh my gosh, hello <laughs> Grayson. He is still wearing his PJs. Um, let's go ahead and change his outfit. I wish you can actually save outfits within this game. Okay, so he has his outfit on for going out. So let's go all the way over here and go to the top. Um, I'm not sure if he can climb. Um, let's go ahead and test that out first. All right, so Grayson, are you going to be able to climb this ladder? I want to see if you can climb too. I don't think he can climb. Okay, so let's go ahead and carry him up there. I think he's kind of scared to go up here. Wait, am I? Wait, okay. Ah! Okay, there we go. I am somehow climbing while holding a baby in my hands. That is talent, guys. That is complete talent. Okay, can we zip line? Um, let's go ahead and do one with him. Oh, wait. Oh, what? Oh my gosh, what happened to my hand? <laughs> what happened to my hand? Oh my gosh, okay. I don't think you can zip line. I don't think the kids can zip line. Because uh, this just gives me the option. Oh my gosh. <gasps> no, crazy. No. <laughs> oh my gosh okay i think what would be a really cool thing to add to zip lining for the kids is that not only can you zip line but the kids can zip line as well so for example when you go on the zip line i think it would be really cool for them to add like a feature where your child can ride on your back and like have different straps and stuff on you so that they don't fall or get hurt like what just happened right there so i think that'd be really cool to add okay so the next thing that i want to check out is the new five family styled cars I don't think I'm going to be able to buy any of them um, just because I don't have enough money as you guys can see but oh my gosh wait okay so let's go ahead and get into the car and let's go to the car shop come on Grayson let's go oh my gosh what is are you okay oh my gosh Grayson are you okay 
Okay, so let's go ahead and go in here. I don't think there is any in here just yet. Okay, I want to know what these style cars are. I heard there is a Tesla car. This one's interesting. This one looks like a family style car. Oh my gosh, this one looks pretty nice. I like that. It's like a little SUV and stuff, and it has like a little sunroof, which is pretty cool. Um, this one, I think we've seen. This one, we've seen. Seen, seen. Uh, we've seen that one already. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. Look at this one, too. Oh, that is so cute. This is one of those, like, outdoorsy parents type of car where they have, like, the little SUV and they can put, like, a canoe on top of the car. This one looks like you can fit five people, actually. Yeah, because there's five seats in there. There's two in the front, three in the back. Okay, so that's pretty cool. This one's actually a really nice car as well. I think this one's pretty cool. This one's perfect for camping and stuff we have this one already so we've seen two of the cars already i wonder what the other three are going to be oh look at this one oh this one's nice wow this one's pretty nice too this one kind of reminds me of like one of the fancier cars is this like a bmw is this like a mercedes or something like that in real life it's one of those like suv type of cars but it looks like a regular sedan type of car if that makes any sense so like you can fit five people in this car as well two in the front three in the back as you can see there's three seats in the back so i actually really like this one wow i really hope that by buying these cars we're able to kind of just pick the color of the car as well because i'm not too i'm not a fan of like macaroni yellow like this i think it'd be really cool to like color this like black or something oh my gosh i think this one's probably my favorite this one's definitely probably my favorite. So we've seen that one. Um, this one is also a five-seater car as well. This one is not an SUV, but just like a regular size car. This actually kind of looks like the one that Josh has in real life. So that's pretty cool that they were able to make the same exact car or something similar to that in the game. That's pretty nice as well. This one you can also fit three people in the back, two people in the front. So that is one of the other cars. And then I think this one is the last one. Oh my gosh, this one's a Tesla. This one's pretty nice. I think this is the Tesla Model X. I believe the Model X version is like the bigger version. But look at this, guys. Look at that sunroof. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. I can barely see in the car, but uh, the windows are really tinted as you can see. And I think this one is also a five seater. So like two people in the front and then five people, or five people in the back. That would be pretty crazy, right? Five people in the back seat. Okay. This one, you can fit three people in the back seat because I see three like seats back there. But this one's pretty nice. This one's really nice. They did such a great job on like these cars and stuff. I wish I could buy them all, but obviously I can't because I'm broke. But that is really cool. I love the way these cars look. So we've seen like some of them already. I think my most favorite is probably going to be this one right here. I really like that style of car and stuff. And then this one's like more outdoorsy. I really like how they added SUVs that kind of just fit like different styles and stuff like that. So for example, this one looks like a Range Rover or maybe it's like a Ford Explorer or something like that. It looks pretty similar to one of those ones. Um, this one's pretty nice. Oh my gosh, guys. I really love these cars. They did such a great job. Yeah, this one's probably going to be my favorite right here. And then my second favorite is obviously going to be the Tesla because I can never buy one of these in real life and I can only buy these in like a game and stuff. <laughs> so that is pretty much all the five new family cars. There are definitely a bunch of like SUVs and stuff like that that can fit five people, which is great. So the last thing that I want to check out in this update is the construction site. So we were able to see the construction site in the last update video that I did for Parenthood and there is actually something that I missed in that update as well which I'll show you guys. Okay so if we go to the construction site they are building something over here okay so this is new so this building was not here last time we checked it out so it looks like it's not that finished i really loved how they did like a half complete like building like this i think that's pretty cool as well to so kind of just add like the feel of something like actually being built here instead of it just magically appearing that might actually be a pet store or pet shop so moving on to the feature that i missed in my last update video just because it wasn't really specified in the notes but apparently you can buy groceries now i think so let's go ahead and go inside okay so look at oh my gosh <laughs> out of stock that's so funny okay so we have some options right here to buy some groceries like a baby bottle we also have a juice box and some chocolate bars and then here we just have oh my gosh look at that those are popsicles that's so cool okay so we have popsicles there we have some fruit everything else looks like it's out of stock but they might be adding more 
um, groceries later on, which is pretty exciting as well. So you can actually buy these. Okay. Um, I'm going to need to drop you for a second, Grayson, just because I want to see what I can do with this. Um, I'm pressing E, but I don't think anything is going at the moment. Oh, wait. Wait a second. Okay, so you go to one of these people. Check out. Oh, okay. So I get it. Okay, let me go ahead. Can I grab one of these? Okay, that's what I was missing. Okay, so you can actually go grocery shopping like this and then have it be put in your cart and stuff. That is pretty cool. Okay, so we have it in our cart and then when we go to check out, we can actually check out and it'll say like how much our total is, which is $36. Let's go ahead and buy this. All right. Okay, contents. Oh, okay, so it tells you what's in there too, and then you can remove things. Okay, that is really cool. Okay, so that was a feature that I totally missed in my last update video, but in case you guys were curious, you can now do some grocery shopping in Parenthood. So if you guys make any like roleplay videos or like to play roleplays and stuff, that'll be really cool to do. All right, guys, so that is going to be the end of this update video. We're totally filming our outro in the grocery store because it is late and it's dark outside. So we're just going to film it in here. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video little grayson's kind of having a fit right now because he wants to go home thank you guys so much for watching make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you can be notified whenever i upload a new video and also to join the donut squad because we have so many exciting things coming on this channel and i cannot wait thank you to everybody who's been buying my merch also i will have the link to my merch store in the description box for like roblox clothes anyways guys i hope you have an amazing day and i will see you next time bye